Today, Kevin and I have three seasonal items to try for you. I have the Sheila G's The Indulgent Milk Chocolate Bar in the S'mores. I have a Snapper's Peppermint Fudge, which it's not really fudge, it's like pretzels. And uh, this one is the American, Great American uh, Gourmet Fudge Bites in Chocolate Peppermint. And we just recently uh, reviewed, well, not recent, but not that long ago, we reviewed some of these and then they came out with the seasonal. Yeah. So I think that's neat. And we bought both of mine at uh, Tuesday morning. Um, this one, the, the fudge was $3.99 and this one was right there. $3.29. And then the Sheila G's came from the Fresh Market for $5.99. Uh, Everything's more expensive than the Fresh Market. <laughs> at the Fresh Market, yeah. Over the so year. these are Sheila G's the Indulgent Milk Chocolate Bark S'mores. They are graham cracker pieces and miniature marshmallows in rich milk chocolate drizzled with a toasted sugar caramel coating. A chocolate snacking indulgence you can feel good about. Um, yeah, we were, it wasn't that long ago. We tried something from her. 40 grams is 200 calories. You're right. Or a cast of picture. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it is a resealable bag. Always a good thing. And I'm just going to pour some out. If you care about calories, then you need to weigh these. Yeah, because they're all uneven. Yes. Let me make sure you want with the marshmallow. What is that dark chocolate? It's milk chocolate. Mm. Mm. The texture of that yeah, I like it. is incredible. I mean, it's more like a bark than a brittle, though. Oh, it says bark. Okay. Bark. I thought it said brittle for some reason. Um, I mean, I could devour that whole bag. Yeah, it is really good. I like the flavor of, of the chocolate. I do think the chocolate has a little bit of darkness to it though. I love that. I but would, you can taste the gram, you can taste the marshmallow a little bit. Mm-hmm. Really good. I would give that a five out of five. I think that is I wouldn't quite go that high, but it's it's Oh good. I love it. I would buy that all the time. Um and I wonder how much it would there's three servings uh no, so so got six hundred calories. You, if you, if the you eat the whole bag, well, I'm thinking of me, and I could yeah, literally, eat the whole bag. I could devour that whole bag. But you know what? Let me say this for those people who are sneaky with their calories, like me. 600 calories is less than Ben and Jerry's. Oh yeah. So you could eat this entire bag instead of eating a, a pint of Ben and Jerry's. I love it. I think it's delicious. Good, good, good. Yeah. Okay, so you want to try these next? Yeah. Okay. Right. These are um, snappers. Pretzels, caramel, fudge, peppermint. Uh, no preservatives, no artificial flavors. Um, one ounce, 28 grams is 120 calories. And it just says pretzels, caramel fudge, and crushed peppermint. And these are out of Pennsylvania. This is 100 years Ooh. of family. These look fancy. Something. They look like they do on the front. They look like. Um, look how little those pretzels are. Like miniature. Oh, they're so cute. Those are literally miniature pretzels. That's how big the pretzels are. Oh Let's my see, like, goodness. Her. Yeah, that's how they're big they are. They're adorable. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's got like a little dollop of like a chocolate of the fudges in the middle. Hmm. I got caught that, that mix. I got salt. Mm hmm. The pretzels are very salty. Mmm. That is so delicious. And you do get a slight mint flavor, but it's not like a, it's not the, like a bold, super bold. No. I mean, it's there. Mm hmm. But it's just the right amount. Mm hmm. There's a chewiness to it. In that middle section. Mm hmm. Yeah. Yeah, the middle is very chewy. I don't like those. But I love the amount of salt you get. Mm -hmm. It's got a good amount of crunch to chew. Mm -hmm. The peppermint reminds you, you get a little bit of the peppermint flavor, but you also get that like just a little bit of cooling. I think it's sensation. a candy cane flavor. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, not group. That is very good. Those are good. So if you were going to write those, what would you write them? Uh, probably about a four. But I would have given these probably about a three, so. 
Oh my gosh. How just, did you say that? I don't like that? that dark chocolate bitterness kind. So. Oh my goodness. See, that's what you have to try things because our opinions vary. I mean, for me, solid five there. Um, these I would give like a four and a half because mm. I love them. I think they're delicious. Yeah, I think those are definitely yeah. good. I think these are better than the other ones. Oh, well, I don't. And you don't. Mm -mm. No, but I, I still like them very, very much. I'm not putting them down because I do mm. like them. They're very good. Now, this is the Great American Veg Company Gourmet Veg Bites, chocolate peppermint, individually wrapped bites of fudgy goodness. Oh, that's good. So, they're little squares. Of fudge. Well, they're not little. We're going to need, well, we, we can we bite can it, I guess. We'll bite it. So, for $4, we got six pieces of fudge. <laughs> that's about typical. I felt like we got ripped off. No, that's fine about mine. Because you buy fudge, fudge is expensive. Two pieces, there's three servings in the container. Two pieces are 186 calories. You're gonna break it and get some of that. And these are made in Bountiful, Utah. Um, there's a lot of peppermint pieces in there, but not a lot. How many are there? GreatAmericanFudge.com. It's supposed to have peppermint in it, but I don't really don't see a lot. My piece did not have any. Peppermint pieces in it at least. Mind it neither. Hmm. But that looks like it does. I think so. I don't see if any of them do. I don't see if any of them. Um, it's mostly chocolate. Mm -hmm. I do get a teeny tiny hint of peppermint. But I think if you'd blindfolded me or just given me that without telling me, I wouldn't have even picked that up. Mm -mm. Knowing it's there, I pick it up more just because I know it's there. But yeah, if you didn't tell me there's peppermint in there, I would never already guess that. Unfortunately, I would pass on these completely. Yeah, and there, yeah even the fudge itself is not that great of fudge. It's mm -hmm. okay. Uh, I like the texture of it, but the flavor of it. Um, kind of flat. You know? mm -hmm. Yeah, I would pass on that one. And. and yeah, I just yeah. Especially would, after eating these, they're so yeah, different. Yeah, yeah. After eating those, um, and the first one is just s'mores. The Sheila Jesus is s'mores. It has nothing to do with peppermint. But after having those and just the high quality that's there, I just have to say I would pass on these. Yeah. Now, if you really like fudge, I guess you could give them a try. You might like the flavors. Yeah, I, I, would, I would totally give them a try if you if you want something fudgy. If you don't aren't interested in s'mores or the pretzels, the sauciness of the pretzels. If you want something soft and easy to eat, because these are easy mm -hmm. to eat. The snappers, there's some chewiness yeah, to some the middle. Stickiness. So yes, yeah, so those if you have trouble with your teeth, those are likely to get stuck in your teeth. The Sheila G's. I don't That's have melted chocolate, any basically. problems with that at all. Yeah. Uh, but if you do want something soft, then this is the way to go. Yeah, out of the three, there are better fudges out there. Though. But I didn't get the peppermint. It actually shows pieces of peppermint I, on the... What's funny is I don't even see them sticking out of any of these. No. You think when they cut them, you'd see something. Something. And, and there's just... Yeah, it's just... They they didn't put enough peppermint, at least not in our batch. We might have gotten a dead batch, That's but uh, the, so for that reason, I'm gonna say yeah. I would skip. I would skip that one. Well, these are the ones I would get. These are the ones you would get. I love this. So whatever you're in the mood for. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.